Hello, all of you YouTube maniacs. Tonight, I'm going to be taking a look at Candy Cone Creations Chocolate Creamery. It says, real sugar cone filled with delicious creamy chocolate. And it's by Cold Stone Creamery. Now, um, where did we find this? We found this at a, well, my sister, to be more specific, found this at a store we have here called five below and i know it's in some other states but i don't know if it's actually out of the country um <clears throat> now i saw something similar to this in a cjr video and uh it was from a japan like a japan goodie box or something like that and it's a cone and there really isn't much here so i will let you guys know if i think that you should try it out <clears throat> And uh, this is going to be pretty a pretty short one, but it should be pretty good. I don't know. I guess we'll see. All right. Hopefully this doesn't give me any difficulty opening it, though. And in my last video, I pretty much forgot to use my rating scale. But, you know, that doesn't really matter all that much. Because usually I'm pretty extensive on what I think about the products that I review for you guys. And this particular product is being annoying and not wanting to come open with the one-handed approach. Okay. Alright. Probably going to have to end up destroying the packaging in order to get this item out of here. Okay, I see foil. Okay, there's the item. You know what this reminds me of? It reminds me of a mini nutty bar, or not, not a nutty bar, a mini drumstick. Okay. There's the lid. It's made of plastic, strangely enough. I don't like the idea of plastic leaning up against the food directly like that. That's not good. And again, this was purchased at Five Below. Oh, that's actually pretty neat. The uh, little candy uh, topping things there. Kind of reminds me of a cosmic brownie. But you know, I'm not a big fan of these. I like, I would have preferred nuts on top of there. Alright, um, like I said, there really isn't much to this thing. And, uh, I, on appearance though, I really like that. I'd go with a four on that. Four out of five. But, uh, I'm gonna go take a bite and I'll let you guys know what I think. Hmm. Okay. Well, you know, I don't know what you're doing, Cold Stone, but, uh, well, before I make the full judgment on this, I'm going to take one more bite, and then we'll see. Okay. This thing said it was chocolate creamery flavored. This doesn't taste any different to me than a Palmer chocolate candy would. And I sincerely doubt Palmer Chocolates is going to watch this, but the chocolate tastes very low end. And that means, you know, to me, and I again, I don't know if Palmer really is this cheap but that's what it reminds me of it reminds me of a very cheap chocolate it doesn't taste like the stuff that you would get actually from a cold stone like that rich really really rich intensely flavored stuff that you can't really eat much of this stuff just tastes sugary and doesn't have a lot of chocolate flavoring like clearly you can see that it looks like chocolate flavoring even the cone like when you get a sugar cone, and you're just chewing on a sugar cone, if you were to just go pull one out of the box, there's a certain flavor you get with that. With this, you don't get that. You just get a little bit of like a wafery crunch from this. I am going to rate this a 2 out of 5. And I think if you were to see them in the stores, 
don't buy them. That is my that is my prognosis on this. Um, even if you're a fan of chocolate, this one I think you would be a little bit disappointed in. Because I definitely am. Alright guys, I will see you later. And remember, be awesome to each other. See ya.